Welcome everyone. Hey, today I'd like to discuss this Flight 804. And I personally think this is probably just an, uh, another PSYOP. So let me show you what I see. And you can chime in if you like on the comments below. Um, Flight 804 uh, the deep, well, let's look here. Washington Post, what we know about Flight 804. The Egyptian airliner was carrying 66 people. Okay, that's right off the bat. 66, see that number anywhere? Start thinking. It, this little graphic here, the plane took off at 11.21 p.m. Central Eastern Standard Time. Or whatever that is. Then that here at 2.30 a.m. Cairo time. It was contact was lost. So I've been reading up on some of this numerology that these morons believe in. And apparently double digit numbers are quote unquote sacred to them. So 11, 22, 33. Those you don't reduce down if you ever get to that point. So 11, you leave it alone, but you do reduce it to 21 to 3, because 2 plus 1 is 3. So 3 times 11, of course, is 33. 230. 2 over 3 would be a fraction, would be 2 thirds. 2 thirds in the decimal form would be 0.666. Um, 604 itself, I'm not really sure what what uh, they're comes up with 12 you know reduce that and you got three um i don't know third world war who knows i don't know anyway uh, i really can't figure that one out but 1109 11 9 once again is very prominent uh just look at my previous video 11 9 9 11 if you want if you haven't heard that before you do have the 56 regular passengers which of course five plus six is 11 and they have that in bold. Got to put that in bold, uh, you know, because apparently the seven crew members and the three security officers don't count. <clears throat> but um, the Airbus A320. Now this is this is cryptic right here. Three two two three. Remember, in numerology you don't count zeros. So as above, so below. It's a mirror of each other. Two thirds. Again, in decimal form is 0.666. Uh, the 37,000 feet, I don't know what they're trying to figure uh, code on there. It's highlighted, so there must be something to it, or bolded, I should say. Although, uh, 3 plus 7 is 10, or 3 times 7 is 21. Um, so I don't know on that one. So maybe someone else can decode that one and put it down in the comments below. Um... But what really caught my eye was when they sh when I saw this map right here. Now, what's not on here is the most important part, and that's the latitude and longitudinal lines. Now, pay attention where this is at here on the... This is a uh, fake globe map, so things are going to be a little bit twisted and distorted. But notice where Alexandria, Cairo, Cyprus... Beirut, Tel Aviv, you know, you, you gotta understand Crete's over here, so you know the area. So if we look on the uh, proverbial fake globe, and we zoom in on that area, what latitude and longitudinal lines do you see? Here you have the latitude lines and the longitude lines. You've got the 33 degree mark for latitude and longitude all in that general vicinity of where that plane supposedly crashed into the sea 33 plus 33 equals 66 uh, if we look at it on the flat earth map it looks even better or worse depending on how you look at it notice the uh, going from the inside to the outside you have the latitude line and the 33 degree mark because here's the 30 
each one of these little squares, black and white, black and white, was five degrees of latitude. So this is the 35 degree mark here. This is the 40 degree mark here. So 33 would be right here, right by the E, just uh, southwest of Cyprus. And longitudinally, there's the 30 degree mark. There's the 45, so 33 would be right here, right along the line. And it puts us right there. So once again, it's just fakery. It's just a psyop. I mean, it's just psychological operation on, on everyone. Now, is there a hidden meaning behind it with the numbers? I mean, 11-9? I don't know. It could be. But that 11-9 keeps popping up everywhere. So, again, more bullshit to deal with. And uh, don't believe any of it. it apparently, now, if there were people on that plane that died, may God have mercy on their souls. But right now, this is uh, stirring up to be just another psychological operation like everything else that's thrown our way. Anyway, that's it.